Terry and I were in Moab, and uh, there's a lot of national parks in that area of, of Utah. And the one right there is Arches National Park, and so we went through the park, and we've come to realize that national parks are great places, but in some instances they just don't fit us very well. You kind of feel like you're on a conveyor belt, there's so much traffic. Uh, it's hard to get a parking place to go walk out and see something and you just feel like you're holding somebody up if you do anything and or they're holding you up waiting on a parking spot kind of thing. So we've gotten used to uh, checking out some of the more obscure sites in an area and trying to stay at less populated campgrounds. If we're not actually out boondocking on BLM land, um, we've enjoyed some of the state parks and some of them are, are uh, lesser known places so they aren't heavily uh, visited by people and that's kind of like where we're staying now there aren't very many people there at all but uh, we went and took a trip to Nine Mile Canyon and it was such fun we hardly saw another car the entire time driving there it's like 50 miles I think we saw maybe a half a dozen cars. We got to the place and there were uh, another couple and some other people leaving as we got there. So we sort of had the uh, rocks that are, you know, they're pictographs. So we had those sort of to ourselves to just stand there and look at. We didn't feel like we were holding anybody up. <laughs> anyway, Utah has so much beauty in it. Uh, I hope you enjoy the video. Jump out, buddy. myself turned around enough stuck my binoculars on my face and through the back window I was staring look Holy this just shit. landed here oh, that just happened no we we would have heard it no I mean look how the dirt's on the road that just that just is within oh within a day oh that's bad luck that's very bad luck that's oh my god that could kill 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 yeah if you'd been on the other side of the road that's oh for sure. my
book. I'll go out and check it out here. Down. There's a pine cone in here for a Christmas tree. <laughs> They're hard to find good ones in nature <laughs> that aren't grown. Is there anything that's gone in here? Kill the animals. There must be water, maybe. Those are the trees. <laughs> and all over the Look at his oh, yeah. headdress. That's some kind Two of... Two-legged and then got three fingers. Like, you know. I mean, they never say who they think drew it. Is it an adult? Was it a child? You know, I don't know. Well, it'd almost have to be an adult to work in stone, I would think. To where it's lasted this long. Wow, it is cool.